<coughs> so Wolves uh, won, Bournemouth won. Uh, a well earned point, I think, from Wolves today. They had to work very, very hard for it. Uh, and as well, a couple of terrible decisions from the referee, which nearly cost us uh, the point in the end that we got. Um, I'm not going to go into great detail because I wasn't there today. I've had to watch it um, on the computer. So there'll be others who do a more detailed and better uh, analysis than I can. But for me, uh, the penalty in the first half for Bournemouth was not a penalty. Uh, Fraser threw himself over. Um, it definitely wasn't a penalty. And then Wolves were unlucky. They had a couple of chances in the first half but didn't really make anything count. Then... Bournemouth had the better, I think, of the um, of the second half. A long time they were in control and they looked like the most likely team to win, especially with the goal advantage. But Wolves kept on going and managed to get that um, elusive opportunity uh, from a penalty. Uh, I th- I, it may sound biased now with me saying that the Bournemouth penalties weren't penalties and the Wolves were worse, but I think it was. Wolves were through on goal. Doherty had a good chance and then it was taken out. I would say that Smith probably should have been sent off. He had a booking in the first minute of the game and then that foul as well. I would have been asking for a red card. Uh, so I think the referee bottled out of that one a little bit. Um, and then Cooley put away from Jimenez. Very, very good penalty taker. That's 10 goals that he scored as well for us this season. That's fantastic uh, return for a striker. And with so many games left as well, you have to hope that he might be pushing towards 15, 16 goals, which would be a record for a Wolves striker in the Premier League. Uh, then almost straight away Bournemouth went up the other end and there was a load of tackles being thrown around in the penalty area and then uh, eventually Fraser again throwing himself in the air but the foul for me uh, having seen it quite a few times now in slow motion almost definitely was outside of the uh, area um, fortunately for us uh, their penalty take was it Jordan I- oh, no, Joshua King uh, put it wide uh, this time so Wolves Managed to have, you know, that a point from a very difficult game, very difficult situation. A couple of notable performances. Martinho again, really in the wars today. Put himself a lot, but about a lot. I think he did very, very well. Traore, I've been very critical, critical of him recently. However, the t- past two performances that he's given us, he came on for the last five minutes. I think it was against Bristol and made a few mistakes was played out of position against Newcastle. I thought today he played where he should play and played well and managed to make a few chances and made the Bournemouth defence think a lot near the end of the game, which is exactly what he's there to do. And his pace caused a lot of problems there. Um, defensively, I think we looked fairly secure. Patricio's kick in as well nearly cost us. We could have gone 2-0 down. A mistake between Cody and uh, Patricio not failing to clear the ball there. But quite happy with that. It gets us up to 40 points. We're still unbeaten. Uh, since the 2nd of January I think it was with Crystal Palace beating us we made to work hard it's a difficult away game you know we've seen Chelsea go there recently and other teams go there and get really really beaten well so we've done well to get a point from that game and we look forward now to the next game which is uh, Cardiff isn't it next um, Saturday look forward to that and I'll see you later thank you very much don't forget to like and subscribe everybody cheerio